for me, we don't pray that God give me this. He has given it from the day of creation, and He no longer give me anything. Just pray, make His spirit open your mind, and give you wisdom to be able to identify it and use them for your welfare and for your mankind for His glory. Wash your blood, move all poison toxins. They activate your immunity, raise your army. Then wash me with His soul. And I will be clean. Wash me, and I will be whiter than snow. Yes. In the garden of Eden, you will hear of anointed plants. Welcome to the Holistic Life Conference Series. Organized by Dr. Fru of the Garden of Eden Naturopathic Institute of West Africa with acronym Jenny W. While waiting on doctor's arrival, we now listen to some life transforming testimonies from two patients. My name is Varolin Gacho. I come up from Buddha. On Tuesday evening, my parents have become me say, a wonderful doctor, the can center. They call it Dr. Fru. I know even one come. But the impression that they begin me yesterday with the lectures the way we make them. It be stick it be it be open up my mind for so many things because at, at times when you the only drink I feel say white man makes in there made up of so many chemicals it even weaken your skin we need to know if I say mu come back to start drink our natural helps and the natural helps with doctor Fru it give me I feel say they go help we so so much for instance my own case what bring up here? It be a particular case, but I did ask God, say through my own case, it will show miracle for some other people there, and for us and other people there. Me, Doctor Fruit helps me be a starting point for Santa. Me, so many people there for Santa. Me, the help help them, and any man where they pray for Santa, me pray for Doctor Fruit so that me grow for higher height. Yes, and the message now I will take him back for Buddha. If Dr. Fru is still there tomorrow, I think with my own packet, I will go down with her now. I will show so many people. And so many people will surely come up with Buddha tomorrow for come for here for see Dr. Fru and for discover Dr. Fru for any place where they for tomorrow. My name is Mrs. Aginis Mufo. Okay. And my skin would worry me before me I come here. If you have a day finally, I will not come here. I mean, so how long you don't need to take what treatment? How long I don't you don't take, take uh, treatment. Medicine? Probably two months. Two months. Yep. So how do you feel now for these two months where you don't need to take medicine? Anyway, I feel small better. Now that's this medicine way. Now my skin will be taken also. Very confused my head. If I be taken all it, I really feel better. So mommy, what if you talk from from uh, for about two months now? I don't need to take a doctor for medicine now. That is traditional medicine. What if you talk about the medicine? About the medicine, I say, for me, as she said, the medicine is fine. The medicine is fine if you continue. If you continue, the medicine is fine. Sorry. Now, still with the, the bother me for the medicine and just money palava. If you gain money, you continue the medicine, you will feel better. Now, think with me, I say, I'm good. And this is what if you tell other people the way. They don't know about traditional medicine. Other people already, they, maybe they get bad, uh, they not really get love for traditional medicine because people don't tell them, say traditional medicine is not fine. What if you tell them? Now, if you tell them, say for me, it's fine. Maybe they, may they, they break small for tablet where they take and follow up traditional medicine. They will feel better pass. Now, if you tell Dr. Fuse, I like it, I like it medicine. I really like it medicine because. Even this tablet, they went with the drink so. Now, now this uh, leaf there, they, they use and prepare the tablet. So I know if Chris I say a medicine not fine. A medicine fine. You see, we mummy them, we be born with. They be, be used, they be get used for, for this leaf there, not for this tablet there. 
So many we take notes say if you leave two for just leave them you go look fine. Not only white man, white man, white man mess. Okay. Mommy, thank you. That, mommy, I want just ask you the last question. What do you go fit tell those who that they criticize Dr. Fuse? So one that they lie, say he mess in knocks, he not do this, he not fine. What if you tell that kind of people then? No, I can tell them, say may they try. May they, may they try first before they talk. If you not try something, you know we'll get the result. No, 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 I mean, I'm saying so you tell me, say, if you get you see any person around where they suffer from your sickness, where you don't go to hospital, no way. What you go tell that person? I will tell you, say, may come try Dr. Fu. <laughs> Oxytoxin AOT. AOT is a compoundment of extracts from more than 80 medicinal plants. AOT revitalizes or quickens all body cells in a holistic manner. AOT is antioxidative, antibacterial, antifungal, antiparasitic, antitoxin, antipoison, antiviral, and anticancerous. AOT is 100% natural, rich in organic compound, impregnated with high radiant and mystical energies that give holistic healing and general body wellness and wholesomeness. AOT cleanses the blood and builds the immune system, both naturally and supernaturally. AOT has a holistic approach in handling HIV AIDS or a variety of immunosuppressor diseases in the body. Go for AOT antioxidant. Everything we are suffering because of abuse of law. If you see, we don't follow this and start following man's law, you have abused law. That's why God protects man's knowledge and wisdom. Follow God's wisdom, God's instruction. Ladies and gentlemen, at this juncture, we welcome his healer, Dr. Fu, and entourage into the conference arena. This is the man whose work in the health milieu has stood the test of time. Welcome. Thank you. 
five holistic doctors don't disappear, die mysterious and disappear in America. Sponsored by those from Asaka Industry because they are teaching people how to live healthy. They teach people how to eat the right things. They don't want it. You will think they love you. What you see on drug side effect, they actually mean that they don't care you and give you the other sick. They give you permanently a patient so that the hospital will all be full. Good business. But they use a soft side effect. These are poison side effect. They curse people with disease and then call you back to buy your medicine until your pockets get dry before they abandon you or now show you the right path that the natural path or the church. If the truth leaves you strongly, you have been victimized by the prince of this world. If you struggle with the truth to survive, there is not the truth. When it is the truth, we don't struggle with it to survive. If the truth leaves you strongly, then you have been victimized by the prince of this world. My prayer is that you should turn away from false reality of drugs and turn for God's word for truth and healing. The truth is, God is our healer. Everything God has created is impregnated with healing power, but they are of different levels. God will make a supreme pill, a healer, anointing those things to also give the healing power. So plants heal, everything has thing heal, but they have their own levels. My prayer is that you should turn away from the false reality of drugs and things for God's word for truth and healing. The word doesn't mean that just God's word means his law, his assignment, what he has instructed you, that pray, use plans. So when they say the word of God, don't just think this is every word you say. Every word without practicality is dead. Faith without work is dead. When they say God's word, people don't understand what is God's word, but not there. God's word means God's instructions. Are we following those instructions? He is something to eat plants, are you following it? He is something to pray, are you praying? He is something to be good, are you good? He is something to be obedient, to be nice, to be loving, are you doing it? That is what God does well. Not just the word that they God does well, mean. No, 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 no. That is not the healing word. God's word is, is a whole packet. He has healing, he has deliverance, he has restoration, he has creativity, he has inspiration, he has deep wisdom, knowledge, and so on inside the word. The truth is, God is our healer. That declaration removes all other possibilities. Immediately, the declaration God is a healer. There is no other possibility. Out of God is the devil. I want to know you, when you put this in your mind, why you use it anyway? Why yesterday, or you were not? I said, the first thing in holistic medicine, you acknowledge God as a healer, then you believe that there is power in what He has done. And you know that God is faithful to His word, to His word. Then when you use Him without belief, and you believe that you are going to achieve what is very need, because the word of God does not lie, and you think it is faith, and you are healed. God has provided for our every need found in the plant kingdom, and through His word, Jesus Christ. I said there are only two sources of healing: the plant kingdom and through His word. Which is Jesus. Those who look elsewhere will find only suffering and death. Out of these two, if you are looking for God and chemicals, you will suffer. You are taking natural, but you are working with the natural, the plant, and with the devil, have most traditional doctors, you will still suffer. The truth is, the plant kingdom will deal with the plant and God. Nothing more, nothing less. I'm going to wear and wear this story out to use them. Just put in your mind as you're living this place, you need to be transformed. Then you are alive. When you go home today, you say, Lord, thank you for opening my eyes. Thank you for wisdom. As from today, I've decided that I'm going to obey you. I will eat only what you have instructed me to eat. I will eat and drink from your word. And I will eat and drink from what your word created. 
not what scientists created, what the world was created, or adulterated. What man creates, he adulterates. So anything man has fabricated. You see, everything I did not create anything, I just collected it and joined. I did not find it to the lab to remove certain chemicals to combine. I just took this leaf, took this bag of tree, new root as instructed. I joined. I did not alter God's formula in it. So it's intact. And when you take it works. The way you take the last time, you cast you, you you destabilize it, they become, uh, they become a free radicals. When you remove electrons from atoms, they become free radicals in the body, it becomes a harmful. So when you start removing certain elements in leaf, stability is destroyed and they become an instead of enemy. So everything is intact. And you use it with God and the Bible instructs. And everything will be good with you. But if you go out of that, you only attract suffering and death. They drug and the trusted medical industry that heavily pushes these drugs has caused drugs seem normal and acceptable. To make you feel it's normal and acceptable. The problem with Christians, the problem comes from the original Bible translators, more especially the King James Version of the Bible. During the time when the King James Version was first being translated, witches and witchcraft occupied the minds of many church leaders. Hundreds of people were tried and executed for being a witch. When Bible translators came to the Greek word pharmakia, the original Bible, you find the pharmakia. When they came to the original Greek word pharmakia, in the New Testament, they choose to use the lesser meaning of the word witchcraft instead of the word pharmakia, primary meaning use of drugs. People should be putting something here, eh? and you let ask that why is it that the symbol of modern medicine is the symbol of Lucifer, the snake, pointing the cup. It's from pharmakia. That is why you use pharmaceutical pharmacy. Is that translation means evil? And they use that sign of Lucifer to represent him, but people don't know. A snake. At the time of translation, back in 1611, using the word witchcraft must have made some sense. Witches created and used drugs and potions made from plants, animals, and herbs. So the word witchcraft fit the times. And translator wanted to make that point. That's why they changed from Akia to witchcraft. And today, now, if I were witchcraft, we can the Bible is from the true word drop. After all, the Bible contains witchcraft. If you go to Exodus 22, verse 11, the Bible contains witchcraft. It is all well and good, except that today, when we read the scriptures such as Galatians 5, verse 19 to 21, about the acts of the flesh, there is no mention of the use of drugs that is pharmacia, only of witchcraft. So the the, the, good, the original Greek manuscript, it is the, the drugs are mentioned. But since they translated the Bible like a witchcraft, you see the witchcraft now. So you see the thing has been distorted the Bible. There is absolutely nothing mentioned as witchcraft in the original Greek quotation. Galatians. 5 verse 17 to, 20, to 21 above. The word used is pharmakia, which means use of drugs. It's not until you get into secondary meaning where you then find witchcraft and sorcery. Christians today are faced with the same problems Bible translators had back in 1611, only in, in reverse. Witchcraft is not the issue of the day, it's not the issue of the day. Drugs are. Which are not our problem? And the ones that are in the bush, who goes and delivers them? Have you ever seen any normal animal making love to a male animal making love to a male animal? The human beings are doing it. And they eat only what they inherit that they have been instructed to eat. So that becoming more, more of man. Now we have a commercial break. 
while the program unfolds. Garden of Eden Naturopathic Institute of West Africa, Genoa, affiliated to the Indian Board of Alternative Medicine, IBAM, located at Zimambu Umang Bamenda, introduces an institute of candalogy that trains individuals on natural medicine, fosters competence, professionalism, and cooperation in natural health care. The institute runs national diploma and higher national diploma programs in naturopathy, traditional African medicine, and holistic health and nutrition. Undergraduate and postgraduate programs are also offered for psychotherapy and counseling, holistic health and nutrition, naturopathy, and traditional African medicine. For doctorate programs, courses offered are naturopathy and natural medicine, traditional African medicine, holistic health and nutrition, psychotherapy and counseling, and music therapy. Applicants for doctorate programs must have attained 15 years of education. Practitioners and research workers who have been practicing for the last five years are exempted from this condition. Depending on the duration of the program, qualifications for application are first school living certificate, O level or A level certificate for national diploma programs, A-level or national diploma for higher national diploma programs, A-level and higher national diploma for undergraduate programs, BNM for postgraduate programs, and MD for doctorate programs. Geniwa also needs experts in various natural medicine disciplines such as hygiene and sanitation, holistic medicine, African traditional medicine, history, philosophy and principles of natural medicine and nature cure, first aid meditation, psychology psychology and counseling, music therapy, gynecology and obstetrics, anatomy and physiology, clinical diagnosis and modern medicine, medical jurisprudence. Persons applying for any of these posts must have at least a bachelor degree in science. For experts who are practitioners in natural medicine for at least 10 years, the minimum qualification is an O-level certificate or its equivalent. For information, registration or application inquiries, Call 677-628980 or 699-958893. Email us at drfruayawo.com. Better still, drfruerichard at gmail.com. Try now to get professional training in natural medicine. Go to www.geniwa.org. And Kias Valiman entertains participants and the program continues. <laughs> Thank you. 
Tiger T, superpower and strength. Welcome back to the Holistic Life Conference Series. What's the problem? The medical, industrial and agricultural drug industry today dominates our lives. Drug, that is so serious. Use is so prevalent. Drug tracing show up in our food, in our plants, in our animals, wherever we eat, our water supply, and even threatening extinction of certain plants, animals, aquatic, or marine life. But the problem only touches the head of the garment. The death toll created directly through legally prescribed drugs consumption. Which is to not cause this problem. Which are not poisoning the earth? Have which is poor chemical in the sea? Have they put fertilizer on the soil? Are they polluting the air? Are they poisoning our plants? Are they the ones giving chemicals for fowl to be captured within two weeks to, for consumption and you eat all they grow and everything that goes outside you grow your organ grow and living cancers? Are they the ones injecting the cow with vaccine and you eat the that same vaccine into your body? And then the one person, oh, they have a poison, the plants, and so on. You know, which is human being. Why do I think which is? Spare away your time, you know, instead of doing the right thing. It's not which is. It is the, 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 the industrial companies. companies. So which do not cause this problem. The problem is caused by a giant industry that wants everyone, every man, every woman, and child put on their product, that is drugs. In fact, the Bible warns of this very thing happening. The Bible warns of this very thing happening. If you read the Revelation 18 verse 23, the light of the candle, that is lamp, the light of the candle will no longer shine in you. And the voice of the bridegroom and of the bride will no longer be heard in you. For in you are merchants we are the great men of the earth, for by your sorceries all nations were deceived. The majors are the leaders, majors, the pharmaceutical industries. The whole world has been deceived, all the nations have been deceived. You believe in them, they are not poisoning your system, weakening you, destroying all the energy God has given you to sustain your life. And in her, was found the blood of prophets and of saints and of all who were slain, who were slain on the earth. In this point, there was no prophet, no evangelist, no taking tablets, no taking from these great nations. Well, they killed them, them. And they are dying. The blood, the prophet has been slain. The prophet, the pastors, the doctors, the people have been slain. They have been slain by these people. This generation plus Christians have been deceived to believe that drugs are good for them. Simply because they grew up with drug proliferation and trusted medical industry that pushes them. The church has worsened things by failing to teach the Christians about God's natural laws alongside God's divine laws. Sad. I'm weeping for you people, weeping for the world. The church has not done anything to help. They are instead spoiling everything, dragging everything to the mud and burying it in the mud. But what do you do to the 8 verse 1 to 7? Now it will come to pass if you will hearken diligently to the voice of the Lord. That is what uh, one of somebody will say. Now I'm not really starting to give you the solution. I've told you what is making us sick. Now I want to give you the solution. It, now it will come to pass if you if you will hearken, if you will obey, hearken diligently to the voice of the Lord, you are God. If you would obey God, that is the beginning of the solution. To observe, to do all his commandments, 
that I command you this day, that the Lord your God will set you on high above all nations of the, the earth. And all these blessings will come on you and overtake you if you will hearken to the voice of the Lord your God. All words are being enumerated if you hearken to them. It is the voice of the Lord. The voice of men is the voice of the Lord. And the voice of passing is the voice of the Lord. Blessed will you be in the city, and blessed will you be in the field. Blessed will be the fruit of your body, and the fruit of your ground, and the fruit of your cattle, the increase of your head, and the flocks of your sheep. Blessed will be your basket and your store. Blessed will be when you come in, and blessed will be when you go out. The Lord will cause your enemies that rise upon against you to be smitten before you, before their face. They will come out against you one way and flee before you seven ways. Amen? Amen. Amen. If you can drink palm oil, I don't want to deceive you that palm oil has. It is very unwooking oil. If you go to Malaysia, Scientists in Malaysia, they are all finding about palm oil. If you read the finding, you will be like drinking palm oil that will kill all your sicknesses. Exactly. If you go to UK, they are all finding by the scientists you run away from palm oil. It depends on their interest. All the things you see, the scientific, they are all fake, they are mafia. It depends on interest. They just write those things and send them for an interest of a nation. If you hear somebody producing olive oil, and they have a way to export olive oil over the world, Give all sorts of things, only oil will do, but you surprise what you use and you will frustrate it, you will not do what you will do. But you come to a very area where they are producing the coconut oil, they will tell you what coconut oil will do. They are not producing the coconut uh, oil, they will tell you. But the truth always remains the truth. And the truth is that African plants, tropical plants, are more medicinal than plants from elsewhere in the whole world. So you don't bleach your oils. Then if you can be drinking the warm water, it will keep you healthy than drinking cold water. Avoid things that are from the refrigerator. Don't eat frozen foods. They are bad, they are toxic, they are not good for your system. Eat fresh food. They avoid prepared food fruits. When a food is cut and kept, within two, three hours it loses its vitality. So when you, you, you slice fruits and keep it in the fridge, or you are going to lose their vitality. When you take the food, make sure you finish it, don't say I'm giving pan to eat in the afternoon or evening. By the time you're eating, you're eating rubbish. They don't cut onion. The highest thing that poisons people who say, I'm going to eat fish or liver, I get poison. They will put garlic for that fish. I'm going to eat from some place. I'm going to poison. Okay, that's what you get time for. Eat food poisoning, and it comes from onion. Onion has been researched and discovered as a magnet for bacteria. That is why when people are too sick, they are in a room. You want them to get where you can onion and place in different angles in the room. You might get all jammed in that room. When you wound on your keep that area is wound will attract all the magnet all jammed in that place. Kill the jam. Then by the time that area of that telling you that and that, it is a toxin from the jam. And when it is not a jam that point in the because jam has they have toxins. It is a toxins. That comes from the dead chain that way it poisons you. So never you use onion and keep a fraction that you come and use it later. That fraction by the in the refrigerator is already contaminated. It has contaminated all gem around. So if you want to use onion, make sure what you are using, you finish it. Even if you are to eat it, like say, eat onion more than you. The one you use it, if there is any remaining onion, throw it away. Don't use it again. Amen. So if you want to use onion and reuse, make sure that you just peel it carefully, peel what you will use. Then you want the part that you are leaving, they should go anywhere on that onion. And our health tips today, we will look at the health benefits of tomatoes. Tomatoes, a daily nutrition nibble. Tomatoes are excellent source of lycopene, which helps prevent prostate cancer. These juicy fruits are full of antioxidants, which help prevent heart disease. Anointed Plant is a product of Super Plant Extract and an integrated supernatural gadget. 
with overwhelming and irresistible strength over a wide range of sicknesses and spiritual manipulations. The neutralizer anointed plant can easily be used in six different ways with the most common method being mixing in drinking water. The neutralizer requires prayers and closeness to God and nature when being used. As for the after effects, they are certainly visible because your system is relieved of demons, spiritual husbands and wives, poisoning, mermaids and more. So to restore your system, call the numbers 677-628-980 or 699-958-893. With anointed plants, your system is neutralized from all evils. So anything which God created that gave power, whatsoever God created with His Word, be it living or no living, possesses power. Our clinics are located at Boyer, Monia Mavio, Mal 18, Monia Road, Duala, Old Road, Bonaberry, Second Story Building, after Tropicana, Limbe, Car Street, Newtown. Kumba, beside CPTM Hall, Kumba Town. Yawunde, from Karifu Station MRS, that is, former Karifu Shell Simeo, when heading towards La Biamasi, take the second big street on the right, and 100 meters into the street, you will meet the clinic on the left. Bamenda, Jimambu Mile 7, Mankon. For more info, call 677-628980 or 699-958893. Email us at drfruayawo.com. Better still, drfruerichard at gmail.com. Visit our website www.candlestick.org or www.africannaturalmedicines.com Apply now to get professional training in natural medicines. Go to www.genua.org Visit us on Facebook at www.facebook.com slash richard.fru www.facebook.com slash dr richard fru or www.facebook.com slash dr fru's girl foundation you can also watch us on youtube at www.youtube.com slash girl